Hi, I'm Gary Wyron. We're here at Trump International to do a special project, which is to analyze the golf swings of some baseball ambassadors with Mizuno, and then to give you tips on how those golf swings could be helped or how the golf swings that you watch could help you. San Francisco middle reliever Jeremy Affeld is known as one of baseball's reliable setup men. Let's see if his setup and his golf swing are as reliable as he is. Jeremy, I look at your lead foot here, the one out in front, right there, and uh, we're pointing it, and notice how you lay, his leg is straightened and his foot has spun out. That's an indication of his left side firing too much. He has to hit a lot of thin shots, I'm sure. If you take a look at this shot right there, you saw that was thin. Jeremy does something, again, so many players do, and that's they lose some speed on the downswing because they're trying to force from behind the ball. In other words, instead of hitting like pulling it, it's more pushing it with the rear hand, and he's not pulling it with the forward. So watch my forward foot here. Jeremy comes down like this, and his foot spins, and his left leg tends to straighten, and he never does quite get all the way over with his knee over touching the other knee to face the target. I would suggest to him that he does a gravity drill. It's called gravity golf, great system that teaches you to do this, putting your feet together and then simply swinging back. And then as you step forward, you simply drop your arms. You're not forcing anything. You're letting gravity drop your arms down and then you're turning through. When you turn through, you post up correctly on your forward leg and you get some speed and fire. So you're not doing like this. You're not hitting from back here where your leg straightens out too early and your foot comes in the air. Instead, you're doing this. Feet together, just step and drop your arms, just drop. My arms are just going down by gravity. And then I'm turning my hips strongly through and boy, that'll create a lot of speed and a lot of shots that aren't bladed and hit on top. Try that drill, the gravity drill. 